I've fallen in love with a new altcoin. This has just, it's touched my heart, it's touched my soul, and I'm excited to get into that with you. I'm Joanna Garzilli, this is Crypto Angel Network. If you are into DeFi, you're into altcoins, Bitcoin, FinTech, please subscribe to the channel and like the video. And also let me know in the comments below what is interesting to you and if there's any altcoins that you want me to share research with you on. Today, I'm gonna to be sharing with you about Harmony One. Mando de Leon, this is for you. I said, you said to me, I talked about Graph yesterday and uh, you said, what other altcoins do you like? Harmony has just blown me away. And uh, so I've just gone and bought some. I'm gonna go and share my screen now just to uh, let you know sort of the resources that I have come across here. So just bear with me a second. Here we go. Okay, so uh, we're starting off here on my, uh, on my coin tracker, right? This is my performance software that I use to keep track of the different cryptocurrencies that I have. And, um, and I'm gonna show you in a minute, Harmony One. Again, bear in mind, I've just, just got it. This, I'm, in my personal opinion, this is an absolute gem. Let me just also say that anything that I say here is my personal opinion. I am not giving financial, investment advice. This is purely my, you know, my journey uh, into DeFi and, and I'm sharing here what I'm learning, what I'm enjoying and just, you know, just how, what the results that I'm getting personally from being in crypto trading, crypto investing. And now I am a student of blockchain. Yes. So I'm this months ahead. I will be becoming certified in blockchain. I'm very excited about that because I, I really want to understand what some of the things are that I've invested in. Like, okay, this is done well, but what exactly is it? So I think that that is very, very important. If you are new to cryptocurrencies and you're getting into the space because there are so many different altcoins to pick from. So uh, let's take, take a look here. Well, uh, things, things have been going well in this past day. My portfolio is up $2,886.43. It doesn't mean that it can't go down. <laughs> I'm hoping that as I do each video, it's going to improve each time. But yeah, I, I know that uh, the cryptocurrencies are extremely volatile. And so far, my return to date, my all time return, which is within roughly a six week period is $34,662.43. So the portfolio is currently valued at $58,401.94. And you can see there I put net deposits in at $23,739.51. So let me just scroll down here <clears throat> to Harmony One. And um, so you're gonna see here, it's giving like it's not, I'm gonna show you after there's a chart with Harmony. Uh, it, it is at right now, it is around three cents. I just went and bought, I have now have, I'm the proud owner of 50,022.42751. That is the token of Harmony. That, um, that is the tokenomics that they're using. And my investment for that was $1,421.94. So far, I've had it now a couple of days, and it is showing a plus 1.40 profit. So uh, I think what's important with this is that, um, you know, for, for me with this, I'm hodling this one. I, I have invested into a number of different things recently, and uh, I, you know, my, my goal is to progressively to invest more into Harmony because I, I, I just think this is project is incredible and I'll show you why. So let me just click here on, here we go, Harmony One price. Uh, to give you a little bit more of an overview here. So right now the price is 0 0.029. And yeah, again, I have only really started to get into crypto investing in this past six weeks. But for people who've been in it for a while, think about when there were, altcoins that came along uh, like when Ethereum started, right? I mean, I wasn't there near the beginning of Ethereum or, 
or Bitcoin, but the, these, these um, different tokens that you know, now are in the thousands and thousands of dollars. And, you know, that, again, this is not my objective here personally for crypto investing besides, yes, I do. I would like to make money. I would like to make profit. But the idea I feel of being a crypto angel is that you get, you have the opportunity to invest in something. Or I'll say I get to have the opportunity to invest in something in a project that I believe in. I'm not going to just go and, and jump on a trend of some altcoin or something just for the sake of it. I want to make sure, do I really believe in the vision of whatever that token is and the team behind it, what they plan to do, the strength of that team. And again, this is why now I'm just starting to really get into uh, blockchain and, and the more the specifics of it, because I, I've started beginning to read white papers. And when I'm reading these white papers, <laughs> I want to make sure that it isn't like reading <sighs> Russian or Swedish or something. I want to be able to understand it. So I'm in putting time and energy into starting to really understand more about smart contracts. And, and I will be, I'm going to start studying a bit of code. I never thought I'd be doing that. <laughs> But I'm going to do it. I'm challenging myself. So you can see here the Harmony price is up 3.31% in the past hour. In the past day, it's gone up 8.82%. In the past week, 56.3%. Its market cap is 274 million. So, you know, it's not massive, but it's not small either. And its 24 hour volume is 39.1 million. So, I, I mean, I just think this is very, very exciting altcoin to get into. And, you know, sort of where I shared how the, the returns that I've even I've had with Graph, I didn't have the opportunity. I wasn't a part of that initial offering. You know, when Graph first, I know when that first got uh, listed, you know, you could, you could um, get a maximum of a thousand to five thousand tokens at around three cents and you know, so to have this opportunity to meet that that, that wasn't even uh, an option when it came on to when graph came onto coinbase it was um it started off at around um 12 cents dipped briefly to 10 cents and then you know and then it went up from there uh so with harmony just you know I, for me personally, I felt like this is a great opportunity and I'm trying to learn from my lessons with Graph where I now I have, you know, my initially my 50,000 Harmony and I'm in it. I am hodling that, I'm absolutely keeping that and very excited about it. So, so you can see there. Um, and, and I know that, um, let me just show you something else here. I want to show you from CoinGecko. So just to give you an idea here, I mean, look at the 30 day return on, on, Har on Harmony here. Let me make sure I'm on Harmony one. Yes, so you can see here the 30 day return. This is one of the things I look at when I go, besides obviously, and I'm gonna show you after with, with the, the vision of Harmony one, you know, what is it again? Like I said, who is the team I do look at? you know, what, what is their success? Where are they at? And, and I, I mean, the 30 day return is astounding. 267.4% in a year, 390.7%. That's incredible. I know that with some, you know, with some money that I have in the savings account, when I get my interest rate return, it's 0.1 0 .01 cent. I get one cent, one to two cent return with uh with a couple of thousand dollars in there so to me this is an absolute no-brainer of course you have to do what is right for you i just i got very excited about when i saw this token so um so yeah so you can see the market cap here again 260 just over 267 million with a two percent market cap dominance but it's got a really good trading volume i bought it on binance us as a us citizen you know i there's limitations there it's not on coinbase pro but i was very happy to see it on binance 
let me take you here to this fantastic article. And I, uh, one of the things that I think very much affects price, and I think one, you know, from the price having gone up in this last 24 hours, is Coin Telegraph's article here by Marcel Petcham. Harmony One gains 230% after Ethereum network integration. I mean, that is a really big deal. You know, as someone who is just you know, getting excited about, is the price going up? I'm not working on this on a day-to-day -day basis, like the founders, like the validators who are verifying the Harmony network, right? So they, they are staking the network and they're working hard. I just studied some stuff uh, briefly today on code. I read the Bitcoin white paper, <laughs> I mind afterwards. Oh my goodness. So I kind of, you, you know, it, it's, I get to reap the rewards of their hard work and and i and i do not take that lightly so look at this it says harmony price surged in february after adding a trustless ethereum bridge to avoid high gas fees one of the things that i learned today about well what does a trustless bridge mean it means that it is not this is my understanding it is not tied to a central network it means that it works independently and it is verified by at the moment, uh, Harmony has 640 validators who are all over the world and they are working independently to validate this network. And, and, and this, I'm gonna show you something afterwards which is very, very exciting and why I feel that Harmony One is going to be a huge influencer contributor to the DeFi space. When you look at the speeds of what it can do and with those speeds and um, the scalability that comes from there. So, um, so let me just scroll down a little bit, you know, other scaling. So look here, it talks about um, the um, scaling uh, fundamentals here and, you know, other people who sort of, I guess you could say are their competitors or who are also, you know, in new in this space and are a little bit further along are Cosmos, Solana, Near, and OMG, which I, I know off the top of my head, I think Solana's at around $8 right now. So I just go, gosh, if I'd been in Solana <laughs> when it was three cents, um, you know, it, it's a it, deal. I bought in here initially at 0 0.303 cents, and then I bought the majority another, um, that was 7,500 Harmony One, and then I bought the second tranche, 42,500 at 0 0.0276 cents. So you'll see here, Harmony is a sharding protocol that, uh, with a trustless Ethereum bridge that separates the chain into segments that process transactions and store data in parallel. It's considered a layer two solution as it's Blitz both the nodes and blockchain states into shards. This means, and this, I think this is the huge part of it that what makes Harmony One so valuable, that the network can scale linearly. Each shard has 250 nodes to guarantee cryptographic randomness. And by using a practical Byzantine fault tolerance consensus, the network maintains low transaction fees and single block final confirmation. So uh, another thing here is that uh, what I like is that annual issuance is capped at 3% and then the transaction fees are burned to achieve near zero inflation. <clears throat> and then I guess as, you know, as more and more energy is output on the network, that's where one ends up having uh, higher transaction fees. So, you know, before I said the market cap is right now, it's 230 million here in this article, it's saying it's rounding it up to 250 and, um, you know, here they're saying, well, it pales in comparison with Cosmos, Solana, and Near Protocol that have market caps of 5 billion, 2.2 billion, 1.26 billion. But do you think that Harmony One, if you know, and I'm going to show you who the team is, <laughs> it's very exciting. The team, ex founders from Google, Apple, do you think that? Um, that Harmony One is going to end up with at least over a billion market cap. I mean, I don't see how not. So this is why I right away, after I said I'm not going to put any more money right now into investing in crypto, and then I saw Harmony and I went, oh my gosh, like, <laughs> I 
<laughs> find some more. Got to go into this because I just think it's incredible. And um, let me just show you this here. So it says here, although its market cap may be small, um, you know, I spoke before again where it talks in this article about the 640 community run nodes. So Harmony One is very community focused, right? And that's exciting. You could be a validator on this network and contribute in, in, in staking the network from anywhere in the world. And, and the, the, which is amazing, which makes it really, really exciting. Uh, among these are cross-asset decks, so um, decentralized exchanges, unified protocol, and a portfolio balance app called CSwap. Uh, they also support Harmony. Also supports decentralized app-based prediction market called C Market and LMA, which is a non-fungible token art gallery. So. Um, the let me just go a little bit further down here so so this is a big deal that you know only a couple of weeks ago that harmony is now fully compatible with ethereum and and that also that on february the 5th blitz labs announced a mainnet beta version of a cross-chain lending marketplace between harmony and ethereum you know as we start to see more and more of these breakthroughs in the technology within DeFi, uh, it just, you know, you're going to see growth each time. And I believe with that then comes the increase in value of the share price. <clears throat> so here is the Harmony One website, harmony.one. And uh, they've changed the video today. I just love the videos. Yesterday they had one of, uh, of just looking at, at different people from all different ages, and nationalities, races. And uh, I was just, I just sat there just staring at this going, wow. I think that was the first thing that came out of my, <laughs> I was sitting on my own here. And I saw the site and I went, wow. I just, I just, whoosh, the energy just hit me from it in the most delightful way. And uh, when you look through their site as well, you're going to see that, um, their theme song is I like to teach, um, I'd like to teach the world to sing in perfect harmony. Oh my gosh, I got goosebumps just saying that. I'm not gonna sing it because I'm a rubbish singer. Uh, but there was that. And then they also refer to the scene from the Matrix when Neo goes to visit the Oracle. Oh my gosh, I got goosebumps again. See, I just get so excited about this. So, so excited. How could I not go and get Harmony, how could I not have this token? How could I not somehow get involved? Uh, just, I'm just like, I just gotta be part of this. I just gotta, just gotta dive in and be part of it. So, um, you know, something else that I wanna show you here and, and you can go through, um, go through their, their site as well, but this time sharding, oh, wow. I mean, sharding is a whole new thing. I'm not gonna get into all of that right now because it, it's more technical, this is on the developer side. But you, once you have your harmony, you can stake it, meaning that you can earn rewards from it. Let me just hop over, let me just hop over, hang on a sec, let me just move this down a tiny bit here. So um, see, so here, this is where you have all the validators and they'll, they'll you can go and, and stake with them and you end up, uh, it's a win-win. The, the validator who is staking the network to prove, um, to prove Harmony One as a token, and right now I think they're working on the layer two protocol, you know, they benefit and get rewarded in tokens and you get rewarded in more tokens. And let me just hop over here to um, Binance. Um, in Binance here, um, I'm on Binance US here, and this just shows the chart here. Let me just go, just, just let me hop back a second. I want to go and show you here about um, under Binance US, you know, Binance US invested, um, I think it's $18 million that they went and put in at an early stage into, into Harmony One. <clears throat> So here, you know, staking is a way for sort of like back in the day when you put your money in a building society and make interest. I feel like this is the new form through decentralized uh, finance of, of, you know, making 
and getting some nice rewards on, on your money that's locked up. You do have to lock it up. So look at this. So if you don't want to say go and stake where you will get a higher return on what I just showed you via Harmony One and the validators on their network. But if you want to keep it simple because you're nervous about doing a deposit to a, a, a wallet, and I, I'm going to be definitely staking my, I'm going to be staking my Harmony One. Look here, you get an estimated annual reward of two to 3%. You do have to have a minimum holdings of 10,000 one, but oh my goodness, at three cents a, a one, I think it's a, I personally think it's an absolute deal. And this is, um, this is where you'll go and, um, put your put your your harmony in so let's see oh so it's showing here like if i go and i've got so this is showing oh this is showing what i'd have i guess my 30 cumulative day holder is is this what it would be for me this would be the return i guess it would go from where i have just over fifty thousand. my return would end up being 50 i'd end up making an extra seven thousand eight hundred and thirty six one and that's what I get on top of that. So I think that's, you know, this is something super cool that how one can get um, to um, just these added benefits. If it's a win-win when you have these tokens. So this is here where you can look more deeply into staking on the mainnet. You know, I mean, what's exciting is before the mainnet was live, um, my gosh, let's just go back here to, uh, let me just go back here. I just want to show you this from um, all, all time low. Think about this. Wow. I mean, in 11 months, right? I mean, it's gone up 12, what is this? 2,119%. And, um, but the all time low here was 0 0.0012. You see what I'm saying? I mean, imagine how many harmony you could have had then. So I just, I just, you know, it's just looking at the progress with it here is to me is very, very exciting. So this is the, these are the blocks right here. We can see what 37, just over, it's like almost 38 million blocks have been verified. And when you come back over here to where they're staking the network, um, you have the validators, they validate the network. So that next, it says the next epoch is in 273 minutes. My understanding an, an epoch as a timeline is, an, is, is approximately 23 hours. And um, here we see two second finality with a thousand nodes. So let me show you something here, which I think is what makes Harmony One very, 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 very exciting is that when you look at it alongside, look at the progress, right, of their protocol features where Ethereum 2 was 12.8 minutes to be able to go and, um, and do 64 blocks. Now, then it went to Ethereum, six minutes, 25 blocks. We got Polkadot, right, 12 seconds for a block. Cosmos even faster, set seven seconds for a block. And now Harmony, two seconds for a block. I mean, it's incredible, absolutely incredible. Where you had on Ethereum 2, 8,192 validators. Then for Ethereum, right, there's an improvement there. They're more efficient at 7,105 you know, for Harmony, it's a thousand validators, I guess, you know, roughly the 640 right now. But with, look what you can do with a thousand validators. You know, the fees are lower. Um, it, this, again, this is still a young project. So I just think, you know, when looking at things like Polkadot, I heard about Polkadot. I know Polkadot is blowing up right now and um, it's doing incredibly, although I, I know one can't, I know it can't get it on Coinbase. Um, haven't been able to get it on Coinbase. I'm pretty sure I got, no, I wasn't able to. And also on, on Binance US. But I mean, to go and buy in at $12 or so, I just, I, I just, I'd rather, for me now, I'm in a point where I want to go into altcoin uh, projects that are in an earlier phase so that, you know, just it's exciting to be part of that, to support it. I think that that's part of what a crypto and being a crypto angel is. And then 
you know, I was looking at day trading, but I just, I also love this idea of hodling and really having a strong portfolio to hodl. Cosmos as well now is um, a number of dollars, obviously Ethereum. I mean, Ethereum is about to break $2,000. So I think I have 1.2 something Ethereum. So just think, imagine you've been able to be in Ethereum. Well, here's you know, in my opinion, uh, a next, a different version, right? A layering of Ethereum, and that is Harmony One. Um, platform strengths, secure, random state sharding. Harmony has transcended the blockchain trilemma, right? It's not a dilemma, it's a trilemma by bringing the best research to production. And so sharding, so this is what sharding is. Sharding is proven to scale blockchains without compromising security and decentralization, right? So where, when we are moving from um, uh, trusted networks, right? Banks, exchanges to trustless uh, networks, DEXs, decentralized exchanges that we are able to verify at scale. And that is very, very exciting. We are just getting um, started with that. And um, one of the things that um, I, I hope I pronounce his name right, uh, Stephen uh, uh, C, who is the um, one of the founders of uh, and the CEO of Harmony One. You know, he was talking, I'm sorry, I'm just looking here because I just want to look at my, um, um, at my, my notes here is that um, he, he was talking about, uh, let me just see where I wanted to go here, that um, this idea is harmony that we can all work together. I just love that as a vision. I think it's very important to go, you know, are your core values, is what you believe in, is it aligned with a certain project? And, um, and so this idea, it really, really resonated, but there was something that he said that I wrote down about, um, <clears throat> you know, incentives that are needed to bring a community together. And they're always, you know, when a project pro um, um, progresses, there is a forking, you know, the developers can go and copy what's there, but what makes something work besides having a VC <laughs> investment, right? Uh, is also, it's that there is a strong community. And that is another reason why I believe that Harmony One will be absolutely huge. They will be a mega, mega um, um, contributor to DeFi in these years ahead because just their, their, their vision is so powerful. This idea of, of cross-borderless um, transactions happening you know, instead of having this sort of stuff that we can relate, that we can resonate through using a certain token. It's like, I love Harmony One. If you like Harmony One, it's going to be a delight doing business with you or socializing with you because we know we share similar values. And I think that it's a really powerful way to be able to uh, just identify, to resonate with other people. So uh, let's see, they said that they are still experimenting at, um, at scaling and, um, you know, why is Harmony One going to stick around? Because they have had strong VC investment. It does give them that window of opportunity to be able to, um, to experiment. Stephen also, I mean, he comes from a background of he worked on the original team for creating Google Maps. And what he said back then was that it wasn't possible, right? They thought it was not possible. And, but it obviously, we use Google Maps now, right? He also worked at Apple as well. So he's worked on some huge projects. And so with blockchain and DeFi, this idea is that, you know, a lot of things where we go, is it going to be possible? Is DeFi going to be around stay? Is, is, this, is this all going to work? Yes. Stephen's answer is yes, but not now. Like a lot of these things that so we are in this just really right now in this very early stage of architecture of DeFi. But I believe in this next two to three years, we're going to make huge breakthroughs. And one of the things that um, he's really, really focused on is interoperability, right? Interoperability of um, blockchain, being able to put these different pieces together. Let me go back and share the screen again. So talking about layer one and layer two compatibility 
And um, let's see, Harmony has innovated on the battle tested practical. We, we looked at this a little bit before from the other article on Coin Telegraph. Uh, but I think here, this is like the, the um, these different pieces that are being put together. So for interoperability, it's like how, um, you know, where we're going decentralized, it's looking at how can we have all these different um, compu computational relationships? How can they work together? These different facets, um, different pieces of technology. And Harmony One is very much focused on fintech, right? On financial technology, on making innovations within that space. So they will, I, I can see how they are going to, which is powerful, bridge the gap, not just between, you know, DeFi and Ethereum and then other, um, other pieces of DeFi, but also with our current centralized system that we have as well. So that is going to be very, very important as well. But I just love this idea of that we, you know, bringing the community together. And so um, Harmony, you know, they're saying that they are positioned to be trustless. And um, so where Ethereum, this Ethereum second layer allows us the opportunity to do on anything on the internet, this is where, you know, Harmony is building the layer on top of Bitcoin and Ethereum for everyday life transactions. How exciting is that? Everyday life. So to me, like my understanding is that rather than it's a just sort of, um, where a token you're identifying maybe by your nationality, let's say you're American, you live in America, so you use US dollar, or you're Japanese, you live in Japan, you use the, end, the, the yen. Instead, this idea of we're not going by um, country or nationality, it really, I feel that token, tokens give us an opportunity to express our personalities, our sensibilities, so much so. And um, you're going to see here, I mean, there's some great stuff here, great um, videos here all about launching on the main net. Uh, really, I mean, yeah, I really encourage you to take a look at everything that they're doing. Look at this. I mean, this team knocked my socks off. And, and, and when I look deeper into it, I mean, it's like they, they were doing um, these, the, Harmony One was born out of a regular meeting of ex-Google founders. I, I mean, just the, uh, the intelligence, that collective intelligence Napoleon Hill and Think and Grow Rich talked about where two or more minds are gathered, that there is that third mind is created. Well, here you've got all these ex-Google founders, people who worked at Apple who have PhDs from, know, from Harvard, Stanford to MIT. And just, it's like this critical, this reaching this critical mass and thinking, this is where I'm trying to stretch myself, where I, yeah, I was not particularly good at math. I did not continue with chemistry or science or any of it. And I'm just setting myself that challenge to say, well, who says I can't? If I just exercise a part of my mind that has never been used before, sort of like Neo does in the matrix, then anything is possible. And, and I just, I would just say to you, you know, what, what is it for you that you could do? And I feel like that is the opportunity here with Harmony One. Um, so let me just, um, so definitely take a deeper look at the, at the partners. Um, look, they've got their Twitter, their LinkedIn. I don't know what these other things are here, something that I'm not aware of yet, but other ways to connect with them. And then you can see, I love that, look at all the, the Harmonauts. Oh my gosh, Harmony, Harmony. Traveling boldly, going where? No one has gone before. I love it. Uh, so, so look at all the other harmonauts as well. And then, you know, when you think, oh, well, is it worth going, you know, ooh, you know, when people hear about altcoins, it's a scam, these things are dangerous. Yes, there are some that don't have use. But if you look to altcoins, in my opinion, there are in the DeFi space that are adding value to DeFi and to FinTech, then how can you really go wrong? I just, 
mean, I just don't think you can. You know, you just got to be able to ride the highs and lows of the issue here of when the price of the crypto fluctuates is it is human. It is the, um, the fear and greed factor. And I know I, I've had it a couple of times. Where I've caught myself where I have the fear of missing out and I got greedy. I'm like, oh, and I, I buy at a high and something like, we just panic and just, 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 I saw my greed. I saw that shadow and I didn't like it. And I'm writing on that every day because I really want to make sure that I'm a true crypto angel, not just what's in it for me. How much profit can I get rather, you know, really what, what can I, how can I in my own small way be a positive force within the crypto community? So look here, look at their, their ecosystem of partners. I mean, Binance is a whopper. I mean, they're just huge. Another exchange, um, Huobi, Gate.io, um, Wazarex, I don't know. Then you've got um, Ledger, which is the, you know, the go-to wallet. So you've got all these different wallets here, Trust Wallet. I mean, you've got so, look at, at so many different partners that they have here, uh, backed by uh, 17 global investors. Um, they are um, built here, here. The community is called Pangea. So that's built out there. That, like I said, thousand harmony nodes. 640 of them run by the community. How, I mean, you could learn code and you could be part of running a node in the community. That's what I wanted to do. And then I looked at it and I went, I haven't got a clue. So right now I'm actually, I'm studying, I'm in Ivan on Tech's Academy. I'm learning this stuff little by little. And you can see all their news here, which is really, really um, exciting. Here is Harmony One's, um, it's a Harmony Protocol, their, their Twitter. Look at this open consensus for 10 billion people. It's such a beautiful vision. It's so exciting, this idea um, that they are making a, a reality of cross-chain finance. And, um, and then also they have, I read they have, um, you can download from their site, they have um, their paper which is here, it's 689 pages, a nice quick read. <laughs> it's really worth looking into. Just go through the first couple of hundred pages and, um, and you know, if you just, just like, just pick out some of the key points, but here, look, 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 this is the part I love. This is what I was talking about before, right? That their, their theme song, Teach the World to Sing in Perfect Harmony. And why is the token called one? Harmony's vision is for one and for all, right? Isn't that gorgeous, right? Was watching that that clip visiting the Oracle, and then and and then oh I got goosebumps again. Why is the logo designed as such? Harmony's community is built on handshake and embrace. All is fair in love and war. You freeze euphemism. The anatomy of wit fifteen seventy nine. I just love all of this. And then there's a really super cool um interview that you can check out over here where Stephen. I talked about how they raised 18 million seed round to scale consensus for 10 billion people. Just a little challenge. Oh, look, here it is. Look at this team. Look at this. Isn't this just so beautiful? Oh my goodness. Look, these, this is how Harmony One was born. This is how it has come about and is here now. So you can see all the founders and they would, um, they came from this weekly gathering of ex Google entrepreneurs that quickly turned into TGI blockchain. Just so cool. So just take a look at their story at length. You know, just look at this, look at these people, beautiful, beautiful energy. I just love it. So, so special. And um, I just, I just think that what is so incredible about cryptocurrencies is that you know, if you want to go into stock exchange, for example, I want to Coinbase is going, um, they're going to be less, they're going to be listed on NASDAQ. I want that. I don't have a broker. You have to, my understanding, typically you have to put a, a minimum of, of, if you don't have a broker of $25,000 in to be able to uh, invest into and buy shares in that listing. And, um, so I, you know, I was looking into a mirror trade and some things like that. So a whole other thing to do, but just that, you know, it's a lot of hoops to jump through. There's a lot of barriers to entry, whereas there is no barrier to entry to being able to go and 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 be part of a growing vision. 
And I just, again, you know, Amanda de Leon, you asked me, right, what is the alt what is the alt coin that I love? This, I just feel this is just something, it is, it is an absolute gem. I see it doing incredible things. And, and that is just for me at a, 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 a gut instinct level. You gotta trust, you know, trust your own instinct with what you do. Like I said, this is not investment advice. This is not any type of advice to you. I'm just saying for me, my gut instinct and my heart sings, yes, 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 yes. Harmony one, harmony one. I love you, I love you, I love you, I love you, I love you. I'm Joanna Garzilli. Thank you for being with me here as a crypto angel, as part of Crypto Angel Network. And I look forward to connecting with you next time. Please like, comment, let me know the altcoins you're interested in, anything else you want me to cover. And yes, light up my like button by subscribing and to get my notifications.